Hey everybody, this is Sheets, and it's a weird slate I picked to do these updates because this is just crazy. We, we finally have someone that I th think we can guarantee is on the optimal. So Fernandez just got the KO in the first round over um, over uh, Muhammad Yaya. It's going to put him up like 100 and what's that? Let's see. Give him, give him, it's going to give him 115 points. So he is in all the optimals. Right? So that that's easy. So to figure out what's live, it, it seems kind of sick, but if we search all my 150 lineups for ones with Sam Hughes and Fernandez and nobody else, we only have one. And that is this one. So I know that you can root for this. And what this is going to be is, looks like Brenner, Chiesa, well, nobody in the main event. Uh, let's say Chuck and Figueredo. I'll tell you this, if this thing wins... Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna deserve more than chopping this with one person because this is almost impossible. Now it's also possible that some of these other guys get in here. Like, well, let's see let's see if if, if adding Herbert because he's the next highest scoring guy here that I knocked out. Let's see if uh, if if I put Herbert in, if I have any of those just for the hell of it. No, I don't have any of with the Herbert. How about just with Hughes and Fernandez? Uh, well, I guess it's the same thing, right? We'll leave. Uh, well, did Gaziev outscore Herbert? I, not quite. So, I don't think Gaziev helps. So, in a weird way, I think that's really our only live lineup. Is that possible for the whole thing? I, I guess so. Um, if I just search by, okay, let's say for sure who's not going to be in. So let's say I do the Cove is definitely out, but let's say Tululian gets there with his 61, for example. Uh, Buchanev is not getting there with his 40. If, if Tululian's getting there with his, uh, with his 61, that's for sure. So no Gor Jordan, Definitely no Bedoya. Maybe Gaziev. I don't know. It's possible. So let's let's leave him in the possibles. No way could allow. So none none of these. Let's leave Dumas in. Just just because he's a little cheaper. No, he wasn't. So we're gonna leave him out. And let's see if that even opens up our our, our pool here. It gives me just one other. So that's if if we can get Gaziev into the optimal. Then I'm live with with uh, again Olazay Chuck in every every lineup, uh, and then Osmot Morozakanov, and then Sanhagen. So right now, it's Morozakanov versus uh, Menafield. So let me see who I'm rooting for. Do I have any Menafields? Well, this one I do not. I just have a Morozakanov and a fade. So I guess that's it. I mean, because there's just no way that Sam Hughes doesn't make it now, right? There's, they're just kind of running out of running out of room. You know, but just in case, you, if you want to just, you know, include non Sam Hughes ones in the mix, like just what we're live with, with uh, Fernandez and none of these, I mean, it opens up a little bit. Like if, if somehow Sam Hughes is not in the lineup, then we can get like the, the these home, like an Olaze Chuck with a big loopy score or something like that. Um, or, these are all unique. So maybe a Menafield. So this one could be big. So if Menafield can win, win, wins a big one here, that that's something to root for. Okay. Um, and then, so nothing here. So we have one Marissa Conoff that's sort of live, one Menafield that's sort of live, and then one sort of fade that's sort of live as well. So we are technically going to be live after this fight. We shall see. Uh, we'll come back after uh, another couple of fights.